Hello, YouTube Universe. This is Miss Max, and you're listening to Miss Max's Story Time. And I just wanted to say a quick hello before I went to bed. This is an adult entertainment channel, and I need to put that in every time. I recently dealt with two men on my dating site that said they were submissive. Of course, what they mean is their bottoms. One of them, really good looking, world traveler, not, certainly not submissive. They just want to get under, they, they want to say they're submissive, but they want to be a bottom. The other one, I had already dealt with this guy. Right before Thanksgiving, he told me that I was not the dom for him. And I was fine block you know and he came back under a new profile he he did tell the truth when i asked him who he was but the point is don't don't deal with people who have already proven they're a waste of your time that's the lesson of the day if they've proven once that they are a complete waste of your time. They will be so again and again and again. There may be interesting things about them, aspects of their personality, characteristics. They may be generous. They may enjoy taking you out to lovely restaurants. Whatever it is, there, there, there may be redeeming factors. But if for some reason... I have already decided this person is a waste of time. I need to just move on and not re-entertain the fool. My best friend is very good at remembering where it is easy for me to forget the dipshit moves these people pull. When she reminds me after I let them burn me again or irritate me or otherwise waste my time enough to bend her ear over it, she reminds me, well, isn't that the one who blah, 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 whatever it is he did? Well, she didn't have to remind me about this one, but she did have to remind me. I said I would not unblock. I would not entertain certain red flags. Once the red flags come up, I should be done. Well, me giving people the benefit of the doubt. You know, I'm really picky. I really am. I just can't deal with anybody. I want what I want and it's not, it's not negotiable. Um, with that being said, I ended up the really good looking uh, world traveler, wealthy fella, um, basically wanted a pro dom and not have to pay for it. So when I told him I wasn't a, a fetish dispenser, he stopped texting me back. Good enough. He won't be back. And the one that made a new account ended up cussing me. He, he cussed me. He called me names. He said ugly things to me. And, um, the reason it's funny is because if he were truly who he said he was, he would never be able to do that. And I know in the community where I live, lots and lots of players. And when I show them these texts, you know, when I, when I mean players, I mean people involved in the scene. And when I show them these texts, he's going to be blacklisted. So I may be new, but I have gotten my feet wet. It's not. And now with this rain, I'm wading knee deep. So... I'm off to go learn some judo in my sleep.
Have a good night. See you next time.